Noble author, I found you at last. No, you're the abomination? Wow, you look exactly like the protagonist in my book. I've been awake for so long I'm hallucinating now. <laughs> Please, a terrible darkness is destroying our realms. The abomination, it looks just like you, Arthur. Well, of course it does. I wrote it that way. You wrote the abomination on purpose? But why? What are you? My conscience? Fine, I'll humor you. When I started writing this whole franchise, I mean, your world, I was young and poor, but inspired and ambitious. That's when I met her, Makila. She was my editor, my partner, my muse, and love. It was too good to last. I found fame and success and loved every minute of it. I wrote furiously and prolifically, but despite it all, my books sold fewer and fewer copies. My spark of brilliance never left me, but she did. I realized I couldn't create more. I had to destroy it. Destroy it all. She said I could never regain what I had, but my fame will return once my readers witness my grand finale, the end of the realms. No! Please, you don't understand. You're destroying our world, and all of us with it. That's exactly the purpose, my dear. Now, I don't have time for this hallucination nonsense. It's time for you to go now. But, Arthur... Leave! The author is possessed by the very darkness he created. I must tell Trivana all I've learned. Archmage Trivana, the author, he... He made the abomination. Then this is worse than I feared. Ania, it's up to you now, more than ever. Gather the Muse Shards. They are manifestations of his inspiration, his desire. His original manuscripts will guide you. Use your portal spell to find the shards.